Hey everyone, welcome back to the Bronco Garage. Today we're installing these shorty headers on this 1974 Bronco. And I want to give some of you guys that are running Fitech some uh, really valuable advice. Uh, we've been running uh, Fitech now for quite a while on this Bronco and we use a multi-layer steel header gasket. Now if you notice here, the gasket's got burn edges all around the ports. What happens is, is when you install these new gaskets on your header, and then go take it for a drive, you're basically heating up the gaskets and you're sealing them to the head and the header surface. Uh, and then you come back and you torque them down for the last time and that's it. Well, as you're trying to get them to seal, the O2 sensor on the Fitech, it stays open the whole time as you're driving, which means that it's continuously trying to recalibrate the motor from all the fresh air that's coming in through the leaks that these haven't sealed yet. So it's creating hot spots because it's adding more fuel, more fresh fuel down the, down the exhaust and, uh, and basically blowing these out. So we were finding all types of sealing issues with these multi-layer steel gaskets and just in general just could not get the, the headers to seal right to the heads. And so uh, we actually made a call down to Tom Hyde at Lick Creek Restorations. He's actually a Phytech expert and he turned us on to these all graphite gaskets made by Remflex. They're all graphite and they can withstand temperatures up to 3000 Fahrenheit. The other great thing about them is they have 50% crush, so they will actually seal any pitted or warped surface that you may have on your headers. So I hope this helps you guys. Uh, again, it's not a fix that everyone might need with their Phytech, but it's definitely gonna help us. And uh, please leave in the comments what you guys are doing, you know, what fix or what ga header gasket you're using. We would love to know. And again, uh, always uh, subscribe for all the next cool videos and tech.